I can't cop the, the I cannot cop till I got at least 10k in my savings. I'm basically starting from scratch because <laughs> my savings is all jacked up right now. Like so, it's just. Alright, so I want to talk about discipline, right? So, I know a lot of people struggle with discipline, and discipline comes in all type of forms and it shapes matter and all that. So, basically, I've been going through, like, a lot of trying to discipline myself in many different areas. Uh, reading more, gaining knowledge more, um, self-discipline, like financial discipline, like in, in many different areas. And it's not easy because it's like, you want what you want at the end of the day. And it's like, well, who gonna win the spirit or the flesh? That's how I look at it. Who's gonna win the spirit or the flesh? Like I, I've been on a cop and break since December. Like I can't cop no weed till that is still till March. Today is uh, February 14th, right? Um, I can't cop till March, but now I'm looking at it and I'm like, I can't cop till March, right? Hmm. But right now, financially, it's like, it's like people will be broke, but when it comes to weed, they ain't broke. Like they got it. <laughs> but it's like I'm not trying to be that person. If I'm broke, I need to, I, I, I need to keep that same energy all around. So it's just like, to me, I'm looking at it like. We can serve as a treat. For some people, it's a treat. So it's like, what have I done to, to, to treat myself that? Like, what, what accomplishments and what, what, like, what have I, what impactful thing have I done or impacted and done in my life that I deserve a treat? You know, if somebody does good or you reward them with a treat, right? Or I'm not trying to compare myself to a dog, but if a dog does good, you reward them with a treat. If a child does good in school or this and that, you reward them with a treat. We can, it, some pe a lot of people probably ain't going to say it's a treat, but it's like, anyway, we ain't going to talk about that. But I'm, I'm talking about for me, it's more so like a treat, right? So it's just like, okay. I can't, I, I, even when March comes, I really can't see myself treating myself because did I deserve that treat? So it's like, even with, and, and, and this, it, it might not be just that. Also with PAC, it's like, every time I, like, I'm not gonna lie, PAC does help me like concentrate. Like I be getting max work done when I'm on PAC. Like I be getting max work done, like, yeah. That it's, it's definitely that but it's also the munchies right I don't want to be eating all the time bro always feeling hungry because I bought the pack right now the effects of the pack I gotta spend more money you understand like oh I want this snack or oh, a bunch of snacks that you see oh I want that snack oh, I want this snack Oh, let me just eat this right here. Before you know it, bro, you gotta go grocery shopping again soon, or you gotta, you you spend this snack like your EBT running like that. I'm talking from you feel me for me. I know I still get EBT, but my EBT running, you feel me? And I'm not trying to really do that because, you know, EBT be coming in a clutch when I really need it the most. So it's just like, do I really want to do that? Like, it 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 just makes sense to me right now to take a longer break than in March, like. I didn't cop since December, and I told myself, right, I can't cop until I got 10k in my savings. Is that OC? Like, am I like I'm not gonna like like what like what y'all what are y'all thoughts about that? Like, I can't cop then I cannot cop till I got at least 10k in my savings. I'm basically starting from scratch because <laughs> my savings is all jacked up right now. Like, so it's just like. I don't know. I, that's what I'm feeling. I don't know if I'm. I'm praying I'm gonna stick with it. I'm praying I'm. A, you know. I'm, that's gonna be the case. Y'all come with, with this journey with me. And let's see how it goes. Like I'm at that point. It's. I can't just be spending. And then treating myself. Like I, I be working hard. Like I work a lot. Like and I do a lot of work. But it's like. Pat can also serve as a slight distraction as well. Like it's not a major distraction for me. 
it's more so of a slight distraction and that's mainly because of the munchies i'm trying to look for what i'm about to eat like i'm reading and trying to find trying to eat like just the eating part is the distraction part you understand like i don't know but yeah i'm, I'm practicing i'm trying to practice discipline more and all that um i had said I had, I had said a quote this morning. I, I said something like, it's not worth it until you're able to, I forgot, I gotta go get the quote. <laughs> I'll probably put it on Twitter and then screenshot it and put it on at the end of this video. But yeah, I, I, it's, that's, that's, that's my intake on it right now. That's my, that's how I'm looking at it right now. Like, We'll see when March comes, because it's easier said than done. Discipline comes up, like, impactful growth. Like, if you really, it's not even about cop and pack, but the discipline to not cop when you can cop, you're able to cop, and when you have the desire of wanting the spark. I feel like it, a lot of mental growth, like people, people take like are all, you know, mental health advocates and whatnot, but it's like the very things that you can practice to try to develop and strengthen your mental health. We're not trying to put in that work. We, we like to sit in the pity of negativity that the negativity that comes with mental health. It's grow like, you have, if you want growth, you have to discipline yourself for that. Like, I don't know. This discipline is like a whole thing that people. I, anyway, bro, I really can't get my point across without. I have to be very picky with my words a lot of times, and sometimes I'm not the best. But I'm not. I'm not gonna take it too far. <laughs> I ain't gonna take it too far, bro. But um, yeah, discipline, it's a whole bunch of positivity that comes with discipline. So, especially self-discipline. When, um, but yeah, um, I think that's all I had to say. All right, y'all. Oh, and I also recommend the, um, I'm trying to start a book club with, um, the first book is Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. Um, I'm start, I'm gonna be uploading it on YouTube. So make sure y'all get in tune with that. Um, yeah, I know y'all don't like to read, so I'm gonna go ahead and read it, read it for y'all. Do the hard work. I, I like it, it. I will do the hard work if it's gonna get the point across for y'all to grow. Like for you to grow, for your growth, I, I don't mind doing the hard work. Your growth is 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 extremely important. So it's just like really people have to take in mind the content that's in books. I, I'm a victim of it, not liking to read or not doing no. Like I'm. Come on, what I look like reading after elementary school. I'm not really, I'm not really about none of that. So it's just like, all right, you feel me? So I just really got to take it. And then by me even reading this book that I'm reading right now, it's just like, wow, reading isn't so bad. <laughs> you know, it's not as bad as we think, but it's just like, it's such a negative light on reading. It's, it's cool, bro. Like, hopefully we get out of that habit, you know, one person at a time. And hopefully I can make a difference with this book club. So, yeah, 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 yeah. Hopefully, I'm trying to make it like a book club slash discussion. But enough with all that. Go check it out on my YouTube. Um, adios, muchachos.